It's centered around Charleston Tucker, who briefs the president every day on all the high stakes things going on around the world. And this team of people in the CIA who kind of help the people in the highest power positions prioritize the issues going on around the world. They're kind of like the night shift of the CIA and they get there before everyone else so that everything is ready for the president when she arrives at work. I play Maureen James. She's a really fun character and I brief the Secretary of Defense. So my specialty is a lot of the, you know, Department of Defense stuff, definitely foreign policy. I think my specialty in particular is in the Middle East, so I know a lot of what's going on around there. And as a young woman in that role, you have to be extremely strong because you're seeing, you know, all of the tragedy that's going on all over the world. your team sort of becomes your family because you can't talk about your work with any of your other loved ones and you also have these odd hours where you're there throughout the night so I think it's a situation where everyone you kind of become best friends with your co-workers and it's nice because we have that dynamic behind the scenes too so the chemistry is there and it carries on hopefully on screen as well um, and yeah like you said you're dealing with such tough decisions that are impacting so many lives that I think you have to have a sense of humor about it. And then sometimes it's just like another day at work. And so it's not always, you know, intense and serious. I think sometimes it's, you get a little desensitized. So it's more bantery and not as hard as I think you might think. Rodney's been amazing. He used to brief the director of the CIA, and so he's incredibly knowledgeable, and it's just so wonderful to be able to just ask someone any question. We can text him or call him, and you get an answer right away. So you can make, there's almost no excuse for it to not be authentic, because we have this amazing resource in Rodney. And he, we did a retreat, the whole cast. Um, Katie invited us to her ranch, and Rodney came as well, so we got to kind of get the down low from him there, sort of like, outline of how it all goes and how the CIA got started. He sent us reading materials. One of our writers used to be in the CIA. So it's really great because you can look things up on the internet, but I feel like it's a little bit more reliable. And some of our questions are not necessarily about the agency, but about what it's like to be someone in the agency. And that's something you can't really find on the internet. And that's what fascinates me is like, besides, all of the political stuff, like who are these people that sacrifice their personal lives to serve the country in this way?